It's a minor maritime mystery revealed. A man who says he's the owner of the so-called abandoned sailboat Kraken is telling a story to CHCH News. The boat appeared in the Hamilton Harbor in the fall, becoming a curiosity of sorts. Matt Ingram has this exclusive interview. As predicted, the east winds are taking us right there. There she blows, Hamilton. Sharing videos of himself sailing on Lake Ontario last summer, Adrian Monrad of Brant County says he's the owner of the Kraken. My dad used to take me sailing back in the day. We used to go racing when I was like seven. Yeah, I just wanted to carry on that tradition to my children. This father of four says he bought the boat from a young couple in Toronto last spring before sailing it to the LaSalle Marina in Burlington, where he stayed until October. The marina was closing for the season. So I had to pick up and get out of there. He says he moored it temporarily in Bayfront Park and says he had planned to have the boat taken out of the water at Hamilton's Harbor West Marina in mid-November. But the plan didn't work out. They said they're not taking boats out of the water anymore. And then I called all the marinas from Toronto to Niagara and no one's taking boats out of the water at that time. So I was uh, SOL. Without a trailer or any way to get the Oakville made Viking 28 sailboat out himself, he decided he'd have to leave it at the park, believing the law is on his side. We have the rights to moor anywhere that's not uh, impeding commercial traffic. So like right here is perfectly legal. Hamilton police say they flagged the boat for the Coast Guard under its Vessels of Concern program. And Adrian says police told him in November that they would remove the boat if he didn't. I was contacted by the police and they're like, oh, you're in the park. Uh, you have to remove it. What exactly the law says about Adrian's specific situation is unclear, but in emails to CHCH News, the Coast Guard says it determined Kraken was not a risk, referring it to Transport Canada for further investigation. Transport Canada tells CHCH News they are still working to identify the owner. Transport Canada is investigating the ownership of this vessel and the circumstances regarding its situation. At this stage of the department's investigation, no contravention under the Wrecked, Abandoned or Hazardous Vessels Act has been identified and Transport Canada currently has no plans to remove the vessel. The organization goes on to say it can take up to two years before a vessel like Kraken can be officially considered abandoned but Adrian says he didn't abandon it. No, I have a cradle. I want to take it to my property. I got a few acres. I want to keep it there. Uh, I'm trying to locate a trailer or I'm thinking about building one. With the cold weather, ice has now formed around the hull of the Kraken. Adrian says he's not too worried yet because there's been a lot of thawing and the ice isn't very thick, but it could become a very big problem for him if the ice gets thicker. If that happens, he says it could crack the hull, but he's hoping Kraken will survive to the spring. By then, I'll be sailing out of here, and uh, I definitely won't uh, moor here next year. Adrian says he's yet to be contacted by Transport Canada. Matt Ingram, CHCH News, Hamilton.